Hi, kids! Hi, Dad! 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 <laughs> yeah. That's all of them. That's all that's every it. single one of them. That's, that's it. it. That's it. That's all. There ain't no more. There's no more. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's December, Christmas time, and tonight is already our church Christmas get together. We are having a potluck and um, just sing, singing Christmas carols and some people are doing special music. So I thought I would vlog a little of preparation time. It's Sunday. Usually Sunday afternoons are nice and relaxing. The kids just play. They're all downstairs playing. And I am making a cookie salad, a recipe that I got from my friend Amy, which is really yummy. Hi. Hi. What are you doing? Lily just had a birthday. Are you birthday? And then, and then I had a dress. And you got a new dress, didn't yeah. you? So pretty. How old are you now? I'm bigger. You're bigger. <laughs> Lily's three. She turned three yesterday, and she is growing up fast, actually. So we're doing cookie salad. It's uh, Cool Whip and buttermilk and pineapple and orange, vanilla pudding, and um, shortbread cookies. Or striped, striped cookies and yum 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 vanilla pudding whipped topping I'm doubling the recipe and pineapple and mandarin oranges it doesn't seem like a very good combination but it is really yummy so we're doing that now and then um, I'm also gonna bring some potato our family <laughs> is a family of seven and so when we go to potlucks I need to bring at least two dishes because I figure we're I mean we eat so much um, I can't just bring one dish anymore, so we're gonna make some cheesy potatoes, which is yummy for a uh, yummy Christmas, Christmassy thing. And so that's what we're doing right now. Okay, I'll show you, maybe I'll show you the end result. I don't know, but mmm. So, okay, bye. So I'm not much of a Christmassy um, as far as baking and cooking for Christmas. I never, I'm not much of a Christmas. Christmassy um, person as far as um, getting into um, all the different cookies that you can make and um, things like that. I, I think I would like to, but life with kids has, has kind of limited me. In fact, when Mark and I were first married, um, he would do a lot of the cooking because I worked a lot of times, um, or when I worked, I worked at a bookstore. I didn't get off work till 545. And he would get off work usually by, um, you know, earlier, five o'clock or something. So he'd be home and he would make supper for us and, and I would come home and, and, and usually would be ready or we'd have to go out to eat or something. So, um, so I never really got in, you know, had practice with cooking other than basic easy prep meals until after having kids. So um, so I've, I've come to, I, I have enjoyed collecting, beginning to collect recipes, things that work for us that the kids like and things that are tasty but easy and and uh, so I can I can see myself eventually um, getting into cooking more, baking and cooking because um, you know it's okay. Um, I, I like hot dishes and one dish meals better than cooking from scratch but um, 
but um, when I do cook from scratch, I think, wow, this is really worth it. It's really yummy and tasty and 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 good to eat. And um, and then I always wish that I would do would do it more often. So um, so yeah. So here's the cookie salad. Looks like I need some more some more fruit in there. It's a little bit fluffy, less fruit. So I think I'm gonna add a little bit more. Um, I don't have any more. Uh, mandarin oranges, but I think I can add some more pineapple and then we add the cookies at the last minute because otherwise they get too soggy. So that's the cookie salad for tonight. Mmm, it's just a nice, fluffy, fluffy, light salad. Okay. <laughs> that was quick. You were quick on the draw. Why don't you put it back on yourself and show your cuteness? I already was filming me. Okay, oh. so now we're making uh, hash brown. The cheesy hash browns. We got Orida, which I didn't even realize Orida stood for Oregon, Idaho. That's crazy. I should have known that. Did you know that? I didn't know that. <laughs> so we're doing one batch of plain um, and then another batch of of uh, uh, onion and, and green pepper. Onions and pepper. Actually, it's onions and peppers. Mmm. And I got Mark cutting onions because I hate cutting onions. And Mark is an expert. <laughs> Mark is the expert. So we got sour cream, cheese, cream of mushroom, and uh, we're going to saute some onion. And then what else? Um, and then we put some corn cornflakes on top. Mm. So that's the other thing we're making for supper tonight. Good job. Thanks. Good job, sous chef. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the onions are just like they're going into my eye they're like going <laughs> take the onions <laughs> rub it in my eye you could use a quick chop you sure you don't want to use a quick chop Okay, so say it again. <laughs> it's uh, let's see, a loaf of bread, a loaf of bread, a, a cut, a cotton of milk, and, and a, a stick of butter. butter. A loaf of bread. A, I think they say a container of milk. A container of milk. A loaf of bread. A container of milk. Stick of butter. Yeah. So what's that from? Do you know? Do you remember? Sesame Street, wasn't it? I was asking them. Oh. Well, how can I ever tell? I'm always talking to that camera. Can't hardly ever tell. I can't ever hardly ever have a conversation with you anymore. <laughs> Onions. Such a comedian. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna leave it on so you don't miss anything great. <laughs> there you go. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you chopping off your finger. Yes, that'd be not good. <laughs> Did you want to saute it all in one at one shot? You want to just do yeah, a section at a time with one stick of butter each and keep it separate? Oh no, it's a stick of butter for the whole thing, I think. Oh. Not half. I mean, I think it's completely one stick of butter. <laughs> stick of butter. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Two cups of cheese. Would you check? I guess it doesn't really matter. I'll just put it all in there, anyways. Two cups of butter. That's two sticks. Two sticks. Or is that four sticks? Oh wait, I think uh, some of the butter goes... Oh, cup? I think, yeah, yeah that's... half of it goes on with the cornflakes. Half of it goes with the onion, and half of it goes with the cornflakes. So okay. One, so two sticks of butter. Because <clears throat> each, each, uh, <clears throat> each package of butter is two out. cups. Each, yes, a stick of butter is a half a cup. Two sticks of butter. Oh, really? 
Is two it? sticks of butter is a half cup? Is this eight tablespoons? One of stick of butter is a half cup. Two sticks of butter is a cup. Is it? Okay. I'm pretty uh -huh. sure. All right, it says it right on the package. We'll check. Okay. Uh-oh. We don't have enough butter out. Oh. Let's see. Four tablespoons. Eight. Eight tablespoons equals a half a cup. Yep. One stick of but one stick of butter is a half a cup. Okay. Good job. Good job. Thanks.